Hi everyone, my name is Joe and welcome to this tutorial. The goal of this tutorial is to connect your GrooveCard account to your uh, PayPal business account, okay? So that you can receive payment via PayPal. So the first thing you need to do is you go to your GrooveFunnels account, log in, and then um, as it loads, you go to your GrooveCard account. So I created a I would say a dummy account or the dummy store. I wouldn't say dummy, but a sample store, um, superstore one at that group And then um, from here, you can click back office. Okay. And you will be taken to um, the back end of your store. From there, you can load. Um, you can go to settings and then see you you can see all the information here but what we're really interested in is the payment gateways okay so there are right now there's all there are a lot of options on how to get payment the primary payment system for Groove is Groove pay but uh, down here you actually have multiple um, options so what we're really looking for is this section right here where it says it's paypal okay it says we do not recommend using paypal alone that's um that's actually really uh, good that they, they put it here you actually need to have multiple options so that you people can pay um in another way okay so just click connect and it says PayPal, PayPal payment app is active. So many to say you can receive PayPal, but you see here, it's still not set up, okay? You still need to provide your client ID and your secret key, okay? To do that, just click this link, developer.paypal.com, and you'll be taken to this section right here, okay? Where it says, uh, explore your payment products, um solutions okay so let's let's uh see where to go from here <laughs> okay normally i would just go here and then i go to my account and from my account i would go down to my apps and credentials okay so you have two options here. You can go uh, sandbox or live. I'll let it go live, right? From here, under REST API apps, you create an app. And then let's just say this is Groove Payments, okay? Create app. And then now, you now have your client ID, which you can place here. There you go. And now you have your secret key. Okay. So your secret key is this long key here. Okay, that's good. And yet you put it here. Okay, so click save. That's it. So once it clears, you're now you're not ready to receive payment via PayPal. All right. So let me know in the comments if you have any question about that and or message me wherever you've seen this tutorial. Thanks, guys. Bye.